So there's two types of tying up, so I don't want to confuse the two of them. But the, the one that we're using here is a physical application of tying a horse up to, to teach them to learn how to stand there without pulling back. And then during that period also that we have the uh, buck along on these foals, we do noise desensitization. I've used chainsaws, uh, lawn mowers, tractor mowers, uh, anything that makes a lot of noise. Pretty soon they're just whole hum, they just watch it go by. Now we're going to go over to the line. Now if you notice, I've got two haulers on this mare also. We just do not want anything, and sometimes these mares get a little upset when you're working with those babies if they're out of their sight. So we don't want a chance of her getting off in there either. And now we're going to uh, hook this foal up to the line. I like to use an extra snap here. As you can see, this colt pulls back. It's got the same pressure on its neck and head as it does on its rump. So I'm going to put another snap in here just because it's easier to do it that way. And we'll tie it right in. This is a quick release snap, so if this baby pulls back and I need to get it unhooked in a hurry, I can do that too. And I'll just go ahead and tuck this up here in the halter out of the way. It don't matter, we don't even have to do that because it's not going anywhere. And I'll step away from the fold. See the baby can move around. He pretty soon figures out the pressure on his butt and the halter and the head is the same pressure. So he'll move around and everything but he just they just quit pulling back and pretty soon you cannot believe and you start leading they're going to come forward off that pressure off that back end and they just pretty soon decide that's what they got to do period.